The following components need to be prepared before getting started. Fill a laboratory beaker with water and add approximately 5 grams of sodium sulfide per deciliter. Place the sensor in the laboratory beaker and make sure that no air bubbles are trapped in front of the sensor's membrane. Observe the value of the oxygen concentration. The value of the oxygen concentration should decrease exponentially, meaning that the oxygen concentration decreases faster in the beginning of the process and as time progresses, the decrease of the oxygen concentration slows down. The value of the oxygen concentration should drop below one part per billion. The Faraday verification can be said to be performed periodically and comes with a pre-programmed 3 hour interval default setting. To activate the automatic Faraday verification, one of the following mode settings needs to be selected, either interval, daily or weekly. For the interval setting, a range between 1 and 12 hours can be chosen. In case the mode is set to daily, the preferred starting time appears on the display and can be adjusted manually. If the mode is set to weekly, the calendar appears to select which day or days of the week the calibration is to be performed. The Faraday verification can also be executed manually at any time. To manually start the Faraday verification, press Enter as shown here. Visible on the display is the current oxygen value as well as the calculated increase of oxygen concentration. Finally, save the Faraday verification by pressing Enter. Note, the Faraday verification is only performed successfully once the increase of oxygen concentration is higher than 80% of the theoretically calculated value. In the event that the increase of oxygen concentration is lower than 80%, the results of the oxygen verification is considered insufficient and should be repeated to confirm the results. Mm -hmm.